Hello everybody, welcome back to Cricket Card Rookies. Um, this is not a normal video, it's kind of a special edition video. Um, this is not my collection of any particular player, but just this interesting artifact uh, I purchased a while back. I, I bought it from a seller in India and that seller really had no information about it whatsoever. Uh, the reason I, I bought it is because it's got these photo cards of there's Garfield Sobers, uh, Rohan Kanhai there, and Lance Gibbs, who doesn't really have a ton of cards. So I was trying to get stuff for some of the great West Indies players, and I thought, oh, this is interesting. There's Sobers again, Sobers again. Um, so I, I was just fascinated by the fact that there's so many of these little photo cards of players that I've come to know in my research, especially um, with the West Indies. And, but there's a lot of other players here, and I, it took me a while to figure out what this is and where it's from. Um, I couldn't find anything about this, this brand um, at all, and I was trying to figure out which test matches or which tour this, all of these players were on. And I, I think I've narrowed it down with a few exceptions to the 1966-67 West Indies tour of India. Uh, and what's interesting about it is that some of these players uh, played in the test matches. There were three test matches. Uh, West Indies won the first two and then the third one was drawn. But some of them didn't play in the test matches. So I was initially looking at the scorecards for the test matches and I didn't see some of the names show up. And, uh, I kind of dug a little deeper and found that there were some first-class matches, some three-day matches in which um, other players, you know, so the teams weren't exactly the same uh, between the tests and the, and the first-class uh, matches. So, so, for example, this pair here, uh, Bino and Davis, were the, opening, the openers for um, the first-class matches, and Bino also opened f with Conrad Hunt, uh, for the test matches, but Davis didn't play in the test matches. And similarly, uh, Sardesai here and in Indrajit Sinji were the openers for the first class matches, but only Sardesai uh, ended up being an opener in the test matches. So, um, and this uh, Gua, Guha here uh, had really great bowling numbers in the first class matches, but didn't um, didn't play in the in the tests. So uh, so anyway, yeah, interesting. Um, there's a, a, a famous uh, Indian cricketer and from a very famous family. This is uh, Pataudi, uh, who was the captain uh, of India with sobers, I guess, of the toss for the test matches. Uh, I apologize for my pronunciation of some of the names, but. Yeah, so uh, some of these players, this is a, a test player, Budi Kunduran uh, for India. And the only one that doesn't fit in the, in the whole scheme of things is this player, at least the name, um, Nasim, sorry, you can see it. This is uh, Nasimo in full flow. And Nasimo was a, a Pakistani player, and I can't find him playing against the West Indies in the same time frame. So anyway, if anybody has any information about that, then uh, please let me know. Here's Lance Gibbs. This is um, it's a little bit faded, but it's uh, Chandra Sek Sekar is, uh, is a, a bowler uh, for India. But yeah, so anyway, some, some photos, some interesting little photo cards. Best guess is from the 66, 67 West Indies tour of India and um, first class and test matches uh, represented here, but with a few mysteries, um, such as this, this photo here uh, that refers to a Pakistani player, Nasimal. So I don't know if anybody has any information on either the company or the, the tour or the photos or, or anything or this kind of thing, but uh, I just thought it was interesting and I wanted to share it. So let me know if you have any uh, thoughts and uh, as always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.